The JavaScript console in the Chrome Developer Tools can be accessed by clicking on the console tab, if it's not already open, and is actually a full-featured JavaScript interpreter. We can execute any arbitrary JavaScript, 5 plus 7 and we get returned 12, or we can even create functions, and when executed, gets added to the scope of the console window. Here we can see I defined a function named myFun, and when called simply returns hello world. So inspecting that in the console, notice as I start typing my, the Chrome console knows that myFun has been defined and tries to autocomplete it. Typing tab, I can autocomplete it. And if I leave the parentheses off, what gets returned is simply the definition of that function. This is a subtlety, but fairly important point. The definition of a function, in this case, what should get run when it's called, is separate from actually running that function. As you can see here, my fun without parentheses simply returns the definition of that function. But if I called my fun with parentheses, it signals to call the function and return hello world in this case. If your console window is getting too cluttered, you can use the clear function, or if you're on a Mac, command K to clear out everything that's been run before. Also, if you type the up or down arrow keys, you can scroll through the history of commands which you've run in the console.